Welcome back to Kinzer's Keep. The end of summer is near, but we're holding on with the spritzer. The possibilities are actually endless with this one, so let's just start with some basic history and then see what we can come up with. You ready? There is a claim that in 1842, the wine spritzer was invented in Hungary by scientist Anjel Stjeplik. Now he was invited to a party in a wine cellar and brought with him some soda water, which was new during that time. One thing led to another and the soda water got mixed in with the wine and Anjel Stjedlik called it the spritzer. But some say that story's horse feathers and the spritzer actually originated in Austria in the 19th century as a result of experimenting with different ways to make bubbly wine. Different stories from different regions, all referencing the use of soda water to lengthen or soften strong wine. So the traditional white wine spritzer is gonna be made with chilled white wine, soda water poured into a stemmed wine glass with no ice. But since its conception, there have been so many different variations that aren't just with wine. They have aperitifs, digestifs, prosecco, champagne, and even spirits. So why don't we make a classic white wine spritzer and then see what happens. If it's too hot and you like wine a lot, go to the fridge to get lit. Sipping on a spritz. <laughs> I love a good spritz. Usually when I drink, I like to move at a marathon speed, not a sprint. That makes things more, I don't know, memorable. Also, it helps with a hangover. So let's start with our chilled wine. I love an Albarino because it has light citrus notes. Uh, I love Paco and Lola a lot. It's from Spain. And once again, those citrus bright notes, but still having a little bit of softness really goes well with soda water. Just remember when you're making your spritzer, use your favorite white wine. Awesome. So let's add three ounces of that and we're gonna eyeball it. We're not gonna use a jigger because that's the type of cocktail this is. So let's shoot for about three ounces. Beautiful. Now that that's done, sorry, <laughs> forgive me. <laughs> right. I'll see you spoon. All right, all right. <laughs> now that that's done, all there's left to. Great. Now all that's left to do is to add sparkling water. You can use whatever flavor you want. Just be aware of how those flavors are gonna act with the type of wine that you have. Since I love the flavor of my wine as it is, I'm just going to add the pure LaCroix, sparkling water, no added flavor. And the amount I'm going to add is my preference. I'm going to add about two ounces. Most people do, I don't know, a heavy splash or a light splash. But if you wanna taste your wine, do less. If you wanna have it lengthened, use more soda water. So let's add two ounces. And we're all done. That's the classic spritzer. Now, if you're like me and you want ice, add ice. If you're also like me and you maybe want some Prosecco, add that too. Some people might say it's not technically a spritzer anymore, but it's my spritzer. I'm gonna make it however I want and you should too. So let's add that ice. I'm gonna add that all the way up to the top just so that there's a little bit of room left. Beautiful. Look at that. Now let's add our champagne. You can just pour it on top if you'd like, or you can be a little more adventurous. I like to grab a bar spoon and insert it right in the center of the cocktail. And then I like to pour my Prosecco down it. That looks pretty great. I'm in love with it. So why the bar spoon? I don't like my cocktails in general in layers and I didn't want it to just sit on top. So when you add the bar spoon in, it has a chance to break through the surface of the cocktail and become more incorporated. Plus, I mean, it's beautiful. Since we have a little bit of citrus notes in here and it's very bright, why not some herbs? I think rosemary would be perfect. So let's do that. Get a nice big 
sprig and push that down into the glass just so a little bit is peeking out. And that's my white wine spritzer. Sour yeah. Moore, Collins, Ricky Fizz, Flip, Daisy Smash, Cobbler yeah. Fix, Julep, Crustum Made. Yeah, let's run it back. Well, the only problem I have here is there's only one of these. So I gotta make another one for Asha. Let's make a glass appear. What? Mystery. Do you wanna grab a drink with me? I'll even let you sit for free. Maybe like fun. 